everyone this is a kalpana here in this video we are going to solve a differential equation using solvable for p so let's get started solve x y into p square plus 1 equals to x square plus y square into p solution given differential equation x y into p square plus 1 equals to x square plus y square into p. You can write as x y into p square plus x y into 1 is x y minus of x square plus y square into p equals to 0. We can rewrite it as xy p square minus of x square plus y square into p plus xy equals to 0. Okay. So, which is quadratic equation in p, right? So, we can write this as xy p square minus x square into p minus into plus minus y square into p plus x y equals to 0. Now we can take x and p common from the first two terms. We will get x p times y into 1 p minus 1 x. Okay. x p into y p is x y p into p p square minus x p into x is x square p, right? So, take y common from the next two terms, minus y common. Then, you will get minus y times 1y and p. So, you are having plus, right? So, you will get minus here. Minus into minus plus. Since, minus into minus plus, so you will get minus here, okay? y into x is xy equals to 0. We are having yp minus x in both the terms. So, take yp minus x common from these two terms. Then, yp minus x into xp minus y equals to 0. Then, yp minus x equals to 0 and xp minus y equals to 0. So, let's find solution for yp minus x equals to 0. Consider yp minus x equals to 0. Then, yp equals to x. Now, would p equals to dy by dx. Then y into dy by dx equals to x. Then y dy equals to x dx. Here the variables are separable. So we can integrate on both sides. Integral dy dy equals to integral x dx. Integral y dy is y square y2 equals to. Integral y dy is y squared y2 equals to integral x dx is x squared y2 plus you can take constant as c or c by 2. Okay. What happens if you take c by 2? Then y squared y2 equals to x squared plus c by 2. So you can cancel 2 to here. Then y squared equals to x squared plus c. Then y square minus x square minus c equals to 0 solution for yp minus x equals to 0. Let's see what happens if we take c as a constant, integral constant. Okay. Then y square y2 equals to take LCM of 2 and 1 which is 2. In the numerator will get x square plus 2c. Now cancel 2 you will get 
y square equals to x square plus 2c since c being constant you can write 2c as c then you'll get y square equals to x square plus c then y square minus x square minus c equals to 0 right so y square minus x square minus c equals to 0 is solution for y p minus x equals to 0 now consider the second one. XP minus Y equals to 0. Then XP equals to Y. Now put P equals to DY by DX. Then X into DY by DX equals to y then 1 by y into dy equals to simply we'll take this y to lhs and x and dx to rhs okay 1 by x into dx here the variables are separable so we can integrate on both sides integral 1 by y dy equals to integral 1 by x dx then Integral 1 by y dy is log y equals to integral 1 by x dx is log x. Since we are having both the terms in log, so we can consider log constant, integral constant as log c. Since we know that log a plus log b equals to log a b. Then this becomes log y equals to, using this formula, we'll, we can write it as log xc or cx, okay? Since if log a equals to log b, then a equals to b, then this becomes y equals to cx. Again, from this we will get y minus x equals to 0, which is solution for xp minus y equals to 0. Okay, so the com comment form of these two solutions will be the solution, required solution for the given differential equation. Therefore, y square minus x square minus c into y minus cx equals to 0 is the required solution. So this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from solvable copy in this video. Hope you understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.